Hey everyone, Tony here from Blocks for the Win, and um, I'm really sorry guys I didn't make a Thursday video, I'm super sorry, I was still feeling sick, and <clears throat> I, uh, like, remembered at like 11 at night, and I was like, oh my god, I'm supposed to do a video today, and it was too late before I could make one, so I'm sorry about that, but uh, G requested me to do a um, compare and contrast video today. Um, I know it's supposed to be Kyla's video today, but since she said it's okay, just so, like, for both of us can upload one. And, um, that I'm supposed to compare desktops and laptops, the pros and cons about them, since I know about computers and everything. Like, this is just a video to make up the ones I missed, I mean, the one I missed Thursday. So, um, the first I want to start off is desktops are pretty handy, they're pretty, um, good. I'll see the pros, I guess. They are pretty, um, they're big occasionally, but like, you know, they're the most powerful ones out of laptops. You can turn them into gaming computers, which I love. You can, um, <clears throat> you can build them or customize them or do anything you want with them more than laptops, because laptops you can only like, really edit the RAM, I mean, or get rid of the RAM, replace it, and the monitor, and I think the graphics card also, but you really can't do anything else with like the motherboard or speakers, cooling system, adding fans. So Dell, I mean, um, for desktops, they have a big amount of customization you can do with them. You can like, you know, take one apart, take the motherboard out, hard drive, do anything you want with them, replace them with like a lot of awesome new upgraded parts to make your um, desktop computer a lot faster and better. And um, those are the pros. The cons are usually they're pretty bulky and big, so they kind of get in the way. They're not portable you can't really bring them anywhere around like you can with the laptop you can bring them around but you know you really can't like you know bring your laptop and your desk onto your bed if you want to you know go on the computer on your bed you can't really do that just <coughs> yeah with your desktop sorry and um so those are pretty much the cons I guess I can really think of you now the pros for laptops are they are can be used for gaming laptops but mainly you have to um, buy them from like Alienware or what websites that sell gaming laptops because you really can't really edit one yourself or make your own because they get a lot of third party uh, parts and it will take a really long time so um, uh, so that's about like good for laptops is that they can be used for gaming also but not as, more po but not as powerful as desktops also um, they can be extremely portable, they can be brought anywhere, you can bring on vacation, business, anything. They have netbooks to be more portable and smaller, so you can carry in your backpack, briefcase, anything really. And um, you can bring them anywhere you want, if you have a wireless broadband card. And um, and what else about laptops are? They are pretty cool, some have built-in webcams, instead of just having webcams, like you have to buy like a regular one like I have and like put it on your monitor that some have built-in ones they're kind of easier um, to use because like you know the mouse pad is right there and the keyboard is right there so you know instead of just like you know having to I have a wireless mouse and keyboard down here it's all right in front of you and it's pretty easy for access also the controls are right there so like basically when you open your laptop all your controls are right there so they're not like spread out like you have, if you have like a desktop computer and on the cons, are they're not really customizable. You really can't do that much with them. You can't really like upgrade them. You can only upgrade the RAM and the graphics card, or the monitor. Well, not really the monitor, because like if you have like a 15-inch monitor, you have to buy a 15-inch monitor, because you really can't replace it with like a 17-inch, because like it would be too big to close and stuff. Um, they're not as fast as desktop computers. Like the highest uh, processor speeds I've seen, like probably just about 2.0 gigahertz. They really can't go that fast. Um, and that's about it, really, just laptops aren't really that much customizable, and once you buy them, you can't do really do that much with them if you want to upgrade it. So, um, thank you for watching, I hope this was informable to people. Those are just my opinions on the pros and cons about desktops and laptops. So, um, if you like this vlog, just comment down below and tell me if you like desktops or laptops better. Thanks.